Hey, Arden men, I'm actually in a uh, hotel lobby. We're at the uh, basketball state tournament. Behind me are uh, several boys who have been just playing games on this computer. And they're looking up these like random games, like space bar game, various things, and uh, just been watching them. And it's amazing to see, here they are in a lobby, and they're trying to really like make something, do something, create something. They're building things on these computers. and. And to me, that's probably what I would have done as a kid, but the question is why? Like, why are they drawn to doing things, building things, making things? I think the reality is, is we are creators. Like, God, who created the world, he made us in his image as creators. And so I want us to think about, I know we're in Genesis right now as a church. When you think about men, one of the things that, that really God instilled in us is this idea of creating, that we are creators after our Creator, that's one of the things it means to be in the image of God. So as we think about um, our own lives and our own work and what we do, um, how are we doing as creators? So I want us to kind of gather around the table this week and just ask a few questions of each other. Uh, number one, um, let's think about like our, our work specifically. Like what are we creating good in the world? Like what are we making for our community? What are we helping to build? What is good about our work? that is actually touching the lives of people because that makes our work matter. You might have to think hard on this one. What is? What am I doing daily that's producing good to my community? And then how are you creating things for your family? Uh, think about around your house and just uh, your daily life. What are you doing as a dad to create good things for your family? Maybe you're not married yet. What are you doing to create good things for your friends, uh, for those people that are dear to you, for your mom and dad? Um, just the basic idea is, hey, you're a creator after God. God created the world good, and he made you to then create after him, to rule after him. So what are you creating in this world that's good, and how could you do more of creating good in the world? Like, how can you work this week and at home this week and in your hobbies this week and as you use your free time? What are some things the Lord's calling you to do and create and make that would serve people, that would help people, and that would glorify Him. Because when you create after Him in His image as His Son, then guess what? You get to uh, glorify Him to the world around you. So I just noticed in this weekend, all the hotel, all these little boys running around trying to find things to create, things to do. And that's part of what manhood is. It's being a creator. So I want us to think about just tell each other, hey, what are we doing to create good for the world? And how's that a blessing? And how can we do more? And how can we do better at creating to make the world a better place? Hey, Ardman, have a good week.